so what are some of the top most universities uh, or the universities which have the best roi which are waving off gre in 2022 fall right so in this video i'm going to give you a list of seven universities which i personally have hand picked uh, have researched uh, them and i feel they are really good if you want to pursue your masters in united states these are some of the universities which have location advantage and they have low fees most of them have low fees and they are very close to the industry uh, that you would most probably want to work in okay so hopefully you like this video if you like the video definitely share it with someone wh whom it will help uh, subscribe to my channel uh, so with that let's get into it i'm going to take you to my uh, screen i'm going to share my screen and we'll go through these universities one by one and i'm going to give you all these links are there in the description section below so don't worry about it you are not going to miss on anything right guys so i have all the seven universities which i'm going to talk about ready in all these tabs and some of you might be able to you know uh, guess some of the names from the tabs that i have open but let's start with my favorite university which is san jose state university now a lot of people are going for ms in data science and uh, sjsu has recently i think in last couple of years have or last couple of or two three years they have started this program for ms in data science which i feel is a good good program so the G, they have totally waived off the gre for this program okay uh, and you can see it here that due to covid 19 gre is waived for spring as well as the fall 22 admissions this is a great news guys so if you are looking for pursuing masters in data science in sjsu this is definitely a good uh, chance for you to apply okay now i'm going to leave a leave this link uh, in the description section below so don't worry about uh, missing the link okay next uh, there are couple of more uh, there are couple of more degrees which are offered by sjsu which also have gre waived off uh, those include let me show you it's part of the college of engineering so if you go one of them is uh, engineering management okay so i'm looking for engineering management this one right uh, now if you see the gre is waived spring 22 and fall 22 now if you are someone who is looking for uh, looking to work in industry as a product manager or a program manager or in supply chain uh, operations manager these kind of roles definitely engineering management is a very good uh, course in sjsu uh, my wife just graduated from this same course and she has landed few offers i would say really good offers so i would highly recommend this program okay after this there's a, another program which is more focused on the mechanical engineering and supply chain part of the things which is industrial engineering which also has waiver of the gre for 2022 okay now this is this year is saying only for spring but definitely reach out to the department and check if you know they are allowing a similar uh waiver for fall also okay now unfortunately the other programs like uh, software engineering and others they have not uh, waived off the gre but these three are really good courses which you can take in sjsu if you are looking for uh if you if you have a specific programming mind definitely i'd recommend visiting this link which is already in the description section and checking for your program if the particular GRE is uh, waived off or not okay let's check for artificial intelligence oh artificial intelligence it is required okay this is the one of the new courses which they have introduced uh, all right so this was the first university guys i highly recommend sjsu as you must have seen in most of my videos uh, definitely grab a chance if uh, you can okay Move, moving on to the next is another of my favorite university from uh, which i always recommend is san, san diego state university now if you see this is particularly for the computer science department but if uh, you are looking for a different degree definitely go to their website and go into the admissions section and look for the admissions requirements and under that you should see what are the test requirements now here as you can read uh due to covid-19 pandemic gre scores are optional for fall 22 admission this is a great news because sjsu is again one of those schools which has low tuition fees really good location advantage and good curriculum okay uh, so i highly 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 recommend 
uh, people to go here now if you are switching from a non cs background to cs background i have heard recently that they are not giving admits so definitely if you are someone who is continuing your who belongs to the same background i feel this is a good chance for you to you know uh, get into this good school okay moving on to next is now i have a few of them but i'm just going to go in the order which i had thought about so the third university which i uh, found out is csu long beach now if you guys have watched my videos about cheapest universities to study in master uh, in united states if you have not i'm going to leave the link to that video in the uh, description section below but this is one of the universities which i recommend okay and if you see for most of the uh, most of the programs they have waived off gre for spring and fall 22 again this is a good school uh, again one of those schools which is not accepting people from non cs background to cs back in the cs courses but if you are looking into other courses definitely you should give it a try and uh, really a good university to look into okay moving on to the next csu la csu la also has uh, by the way a great university they also have uh, waived of the gre uh, for people who are from it cs or uh, information systems background now i would say since they have not mentioned it specifically on their website uh i would say reaching out to them and checking whether you are eligible before you actually apply that way you would not spend that money to you know even apply for the courses all right uh, let's move on the next one is uh, fullerton csu fullerton again a great school I personally recommend this to a lot of people. Uh, has a good location advantage, and the curriculum is also fine. I mean, it's not bad. Uh, but yeah, as you can see, they also have waived off GRE. This is not required for the admission, which is again a great news. Uh, now, some of you who might have less. score like who gave gre but have scored less than 35 or 36 305 or 306 in the gres i would say just go with without reporting the gre score in the schools where gre score is not required uh, i don't think it would make any difference but just a psychological uh, psychologically it makes a difference for a lot of people okay uh, so that was csu fullerton now moving on to the next nu now most the next two universities which i'm going to uh, go through are nu and then asu as you can <laughs> guess from the logo here both of these universities uh, are really good universities definitely they have uh, the location advantage but their fees is little bit high okay so if you are someone who doesn't have that issue or that uh, financial challenge i would say definitely look for these universities so as you can see nu also have waived off the gre though they have not waived it off for all the courses definitely check if your course applies or uh, is within these uh, criteria if it is then might as well get that waived off okay so nu again a great great school a little bit expensive personally as per my standards or as per uh, my criteria which i always recommend but uh, definitely a good school moving on to the next uh, asu graduate programs now finding the list on asu is little bit tricky so i'm going to give you a quick walk through uh, i think there is a page where you so this is the page where you actually search for the program that you want to you know apply for and once you have that then you come to this page okay where you see this list review the gre waiver list okay and when you click on this that's when this excel sheet pops up and where you can see a list of programs and if the gre is waived off or not okay now i am i have saved some effort for you and i have put all of this directly this link in the description section below so don't worry about it just click this link and see if your program is qualified for gre waiver okay 
so that's these are all these are some of the good universities which i have found and i'm going to keep uh, finding more let me know if you let me know in the comment section below if you want me to make a part 2 of this uh, video all right so this was a list of seven universities which are really good really top class which are waving off gre for fall 2022 right uh, hopefully you like the video if you liked it uh, leave a comment share this video with someone and do subscribe to the channel until next 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 video see you soon